oh hello beautiful people how are you doing this morning i'm inviting you to take a walk with me as we talk about purpose purpose is something i love to talk about it is also the one thing that i'm getting a lot of questions about in fact if i was to earn a dollar for every time somebody asked me that question I think I would be rich I think I would be rich because purpose is something that a lot of people have written about there's so many books about finding your life purpose what is my purpose what am I meant to be doing what is my mission you know there's a lot of questions um, there's a lot of books that are written about purpose there's a lot of shows about purpose there's a lot of people motivational speakers talking about purpose and so just seeing that is a question that a lot of my clients will ask me a lot of my followers will ask me i just want to put one thing straight purpose your purpose is not about you okay i just want to get that out of the way that your purpose is not about you your purpose is about other people so the minute you feel that you're doing things to make yourself feel good to elevate yourself to uplift yourself to be seen as this person who's all that in a bag of chips to really just um, do things that are of self-importance then i think that's the number one um, sign to tell you that that is really really not your purpose because the minute you find your purpose you will know it's not about you it is not selfish purpose is not selfish purpose is about serving other people i hope you got that right your purpose is about what you do for the other person so god gave you gifts and i will always say i'm a christian i'm a born again christian and i believe that i am here because there's a mission that god wants me to fulfill and every person on earth has a mission if you haven't figured out yours then you you do need to figure it out um, with the experiences you've had the skills you have your nature your giftings all those things you will need to figure out what your mission is so god created you and planted you here for a mission adam and eve were planted here and they were told your mission is to go and multiply okay so everybody does have a mission my mission i believe is to leave people better than i found them whether that is by listening to them saying something to them doing something with my life that helps them become better people uh, that helps them become better than they are already that's my mission in life you know and so your mission in life is going to be about other people and that's why you see that a lot of people will go out and make all the money in the world they will travel the world and i love to travel and like and i love to make money as well they will go and make the money in the world they they will travel they will wear the latest clothes expensive things they will do things that are of, of this worldly nature and things that are for self um satisfying right they will go and do those things and then they will still not feel complete they will still not feel fulfilled and they will be seeking for something deeper they'll be seeking for a meaning and that's why you see somebody's gonna go and commit suicide because they're saying i do not know the meaning of life because your meaning of life is not going to come when you're self-serving it's not going to come when you're self-serving the minute you start serving other people and you start doing things so that you can serve other people that is when you find the meaning of life and that is what becomes your purpose to serve other people um, when people die they do not people won't say this person owned two range rovers or oh hannah traveled to france and germany and italy and the us and these are all places that i have traveled but nobody will come and say hannah traveled 
to those countries and Hannah was oh you know was rich and she had this big house and she had this and this and this it will not be about the possessions that Hannah had it will be about what Hannah did for other people how did she use her gifts how did she use her skills how did she serve people how was she there for other people and that is what people will talk about when I go I don't think you've ever gone to a funeral where people said oh this person had um, a very expensive watch a Rado watch or oh, this person lived in Mudaiga <laughs> you know this person's children went to this unless they are, they are really just talking about their life history but that will not be the achievement that they will be talking about when they get to the core of wanting to remember you then they will talk about what you did for the service of other people so i want you to think about that even as you think about your purpose i want you to know that it is not about you at all it is not about you at all and so start thinking about uh, I, I like to talk about your design start thinking about your design and when i say design is an acronym so start looking at the things that drive you that's for the d start looking at your experiences and your stories your skills that's for the s your interests your gifts your nature those things when you start thinking about them writing them down um, you will start to find something that will lead to you discovering what your purpose is. Uh, the things that come um, to you that make you lose sleep at night, okay? The things that you can go and do without anybody paying you for, but they're not really for self-gratification. They're not for a feel-good thing. You feel amazing living your purpose, by the way. You feel amazing living your purpose but it is because you're doing it for another person if you start doing things for other people you you will you will know and you will know this is what you are meant to be doing so just to put the record straight for all those people asking what is my purpose it is not about you it is about what you do for other people and um, if this is sounding complicated i hope i can break it down in the future just to break it down because uh, there is a way I help my clients to discover their purposes because it's not something that is lost it's just that sometimes you need to be still and to think a little bit and to go back in history and to observe to be observant and to look around you to find it so it's not that it is hidden or lost or complicated to find it's just that it does require some work for you to to actually find it so yeah I, I hope i can break this down further uh, maybe better if it's sounding a bit complicated for you but just so you know your purpose is not about you it's about other people what you do to serve other people that is why you're here you're not here for yourself by the way you're not here for yourself <laughs>